guys, welcome back to Ari the Stag, TR Tony here in the rather windswept garden down on the south coast. I hope you're okay wherever you are, it's been pretty wet and windy uh, in a lot of parts of the country this week. Uh, yeah, really just an update this weekend, uh, you'll have seen us take a trip down to Alan the Welders last weekend, he's making steady progress on the tub and there were a couple of parts that he needed to have uh, this week to uh, facilitate further development. One of which was the floor pan and the other, if you remember, was uh, a kind of rear mount for the suspension spring in the uh, in the rear suspension area. So I've ordered them and uh, they've recently arrived whilst I've been away. I've been travelling the country this week and uh, let's have a look and see what's arrived and uh, see if we can take them down to Alan, due course. All right. So uh, this is the cardboard box in which it came. Uh, came from James Paddock in the end, so I think we've got a reasonable deal. Um, nicely wrapped up and um, it's been sandwiched either side inside the panel with um, pieces of card, which you can see if I can just take those out for now so they're out the way. And then hopefully we'll be able to get the panel out in due course. So sorry about the camera flying about. Let's just put this on the ground and see what we've got. Okay, so uh, that's not looking too bad. It's the uh, rear floor panel that um, young Alan was after. The only thing is it has taken a bit of a knock in transit by the looks of it. I um, don't know if you can see there, just on that corner, um, it's been folded over in transit. don't suppose that's a major issue. That can easily be bent back out, but a uh, nice piece of metal. Uh, I'm sure will be able to be welded in. It's not a heritage panel. Uh, can't get hold of heritage panels here for this particular part, but nevertheless it looks pretty solid and will save hours and hours of um, Alan's time in trying to uh, weld the perforated metal that's currently in the stag itself. Uh, looks good. And here we have the uh, the other piece, uh, which, if you remember, is basically a cup shape that um, takes the um, rear suspension. I'm going to have to cut this and uh, turn the camera off and come back. And uh, success, we've got the, the package open, it's got all the labels inside. So this, ah, oh, okay, is the, uh, the mounting that takes the rear spring and again the one on the stag. If you looked at the film last week you would have seen is um, perforated and obviously being a structural part uh, it takes a lot of pressure that the spring bouncing up and down on it uh, as the base uh, it needs to be good and solid and that certainly is good and solid nicely finished in red oxide paint so it hasn't rusted and i'm sure alan will have fun welding that making sure that uh, it fits our uny 49m stag and here we have um, ari himself who's uh, just testing out the concrete on the new garage floor. Try the lightweight people first. Yes, and on the basis of you go through then um, I'm, I'm here to rescue you, says he who fell in the river yesterday, yeah. Mr Bickerstaff. Yes, anyway here we are, here's the garage, it's um, got the first tranche of concrete down. Um, we need to have it screeded, which we're waiting to uh, some better weather probably early next week to have done but it's going to be up to the level of those uh, wooden, uh, whatever they are, 4 by 2s on the side there. So we've got about another 2 or 3 inches on top to have happen yet. And that will give us uh, the basis for the new Ari the Stag well garage. Uh, not a lot of room in the garden for anything else, but don't tell Ali the nag. Anyway, um, and the plan is then that this will come down and we'll have a wide garden, as I've shown you before. but. Uh, I've been away a little bit this week, so it's good to get the latest shots, including Ari, who has uh, been foreman and supervising all of this as it uh, takes place. So uh, good job. And the plan then will be to put in a little uh, outbuilding here uh, in time, but we'll get to that once we've got the garage done. But uh, good to see progress. It's agreed to go in next week, and then we can start thinking about building, although we do have to let it uh, dry off for a few days before we can start building on top of it. But uh, going all right, Harry, isn't it? It will be done. It will be done. It will be done. Yeah. <laughs>
All right, guys, so a very quick update this weekend, just to make sure you're all uh, tuned in to what's going on with UNY49M. Some really good things happening, which uh, we're very, very excited about. I'm sure we'll get these panels over to Alan, as I say, to get uh, stuck in. So as ever, keep watching, keep subscribing, keep liking. Really appreciate you following our journey. And uh, some of you may already know, uh, we've actually got some badges now, uh, Ari the Stag window stickers. They're double-sided. If you'd like one, just give us a shout happily we'll send you one free of charge uh, in the post to you and uh, you can wear the Ari the Stag journey badge then with pride so a uh, little bit of something to say thank you good stuff all right guys well um, have a great week and we'll be in touch very soon uh, thanks for watching once again and we'll see you on Ari the Stag very soon all the best cheers for now